multiplications of rational algebra expression. How do we multiply the rational algebra expression in this way? First, observe the rational expressions. Second, factor the rational expressions. Next, divide the GCF in the given, or you can cancel out the common factor. Numerator in the left given, and denominator in the right given, or vice versa. Multiply the numerator to numerator, and denominator to denominator. And then, if you're going to simplify it, just simplify it again, if necessary. Multiply the following Russian expressions. Number 1, x fifth over 10 times 5 over x cubed. Now we're going to observe x fifth and x cubed. x fifth is the numerator from the left given, and x cubed is the denominator from the right side given. So we're going to do this one, vice versa. Okay x fifth and x cube can be uh, divided both sides by the GCF of x cube. So now the x fifth divided by x cube, we have the x squared, and for x cube is 1. Then for 5 and 10 is the GCF is 5. Now we're going to divide by the GCF. So this is 1 and this is 2. 10 divided by 5 is 2. 5 divided by 5 is 1. Then after that, uh, multiply numerator to numerator and denominator to denominator. So the answer is x squared over 2. Number 2. m fifth n raised to 7 p raised to 5 over 21 times 28 over m cubed and raised to 6 p. Now let's go on first to the m. m fifth and m raised to 3. The GCF this was m raised to 3. And then we're going to divide it both sides by m raised to 3. So the answer is 1 for m raised to 3, and this one is m raised to 2. Then for n raised to 7 and n raised to 6, divide both sides by n raised to 6 because this is the GCF. So when we divide this one, so let's just subtract the exponent. So n raised to 7 and n raised to 6, the answer is m. And this one is 1. p raised to 5 and p. The GCF is P. We're going to subtract the exponent. So P raised to 5 and P, and this is 1, and this is P raised to 4. Next, let's go to 28 and 21. The GCF of this one is 7. So we're going to divide this both sides by 7. So 21 divided by 7, 28 divided by 7. 21 divided by 7 is 3. 28 divided by 7 is 4. So after that, we multiply numerator to numerator. So we have this answer 4m raised to 2 and p raised to 4 over 3. Number 3, 4a raised to 3, b raised to 5 over 9, 6, 9c raised to 6, d raised to 4 times. 15 c raised to 3 d over 8 a raised to 4 b raised to 2. Now let's uh, observe 4 and 8 can be cancelled out or divided both sides by 4 because that is the GCF. Okay, so we have 4 divided by 4 is 1, 8 divided by 4 is 2, right? Let's go to the a cube and a raised to 4. The GCF of this one is a raised to 3 because this is the lowest degree or the lowest exponent or uh, degree is a small exponent. Now we're going to divide both sides by a raised to 3. Then the a raised to 3 is an a raised to 4. 
Aries of 3 is 1, Aries of 4 is, we have 8, raised to 1. B raised to 5 and B raised to 2. The G's have this one, it's B raised to 2. And then we're going to divide both sides by B raised to 2. And B raised to 2. Right, so this is B raised to 5, it becomes B raised to 3. And B raised to 2, it becomes 1. 15 and 9. So the GCF for this one is 3. Divide both sides by 3. 9 is 15 divided by 3 is 5. 9 divided by 3 is 5. And C raised to 3 and C raised to 6. The GCF is C raised to 3 because it is the lowest exponent. Then we're going to divide it both sides by C raised to 3. Then C raised to 3 becomes. Uh, here, C raised to 6 becomes C raised to 3, and C raised to 3 is becomes 1, and D raised to 4 and D, the GCF is D. So we're going to divide both sides by D. So D and D4. So this is 1, and this is D raised to 3. So the answer is 5B raised to 3 over 6A. C raised to 3 and B raised to 3. So we're going to multiply this one here. 1 times 1 times B raised to 3 times 5 times 1 times 1. And also this one, 3 times C raised to 3 times D raised to 3 times 2 times A times 1. The space becomes this one. Number 4, 2A plus 10 over 15A minus 25 times. 10a plus 50 over 8a minus 4. So let's go to observation first. The 2a plus 10 can be factorable using common monomials. So let's factor. We have 2 quantity a plus 5. And also this one using common monomial factor. We have 4 quantity 2a minus 1. Okay, so 2 and 4 can be cancelled out using the juicy app of 2 divide both sides by 2 so we have 4 divided by 2 is 2 now let's go to the 10a plus 50 using the common monomial let's factor 10 quantity a plus 5 and also this one 15a minus 25 5 quantity 3a minus 5 so we can factor the 10 and 5 let's divide both sides by 5 because that is the gcf so let's have 10 divided by 5 is 2. After that, multiply numerator to numerator, denominator to denominator. So 2 quantity a plus 5, quantity a plus 5, over 2 quantity 3a minus 5, quantity 2a minus 5, quantity 2a minus 1. So let's have the 2 and 2 cancel out. So the answer is a plus 5, a plus 5, over 3, a minus 5, to a minus 1. Take note that we're going to cancel out, be sure that given is for numerator and the denominator. So this one cannot be cancelled out because it's same in numerator. Number 5. 2x plus 10 over 4x minus 20 times x squared minus 25 over x squared plus 10x plus 25. So 2 quantity x plus 5. So going to factor using the common monomial. And this one is perfect for trinomial. x plus 5, x plus 5. And we're going to cancel out the x plus 5. Then let's go on to the x squared, negative 25. So using the sum and difference, difference of the scalars. Only x plus 5, x minus 5. And this is the common monomial for quantity x minus 5. Then we're going to cancel out the x minus 5. Then multiply 2 to this one. Numerator to numerator. Denominator to denominator. And you have this. 2 quantity x plus 5 over 4 quantity x plus 5. Now 2 and 4 can be canceled out. You're going to simplify it. So this is 2. This is 1. This is 2. And x plus 5, x plus 5. So the answer is 1 half. Number 6, m squared negative 10n plus 24 
over m squared plus 9m plus 18 times m squared negative 2m minus 15 over m squared plus 8m plus 16. Then for this one, we're going to apply the general trinomial and minus 6m minus 4. And this one is a perfect square trinomial, m plus 4, m plus 4. Now we're going to cancel out. There's no same, so don't need to cancel out for this one. So let's go to m squared negative 2, m minus 15. So m minus 5, m plus 3. And this one also general trinomial, m plus 6, m plus 3. Now we're going to cancel out the m plus 3 because that's the same. Now the answer is m minus 6, m minus 4, m minus 5 over m plus 6, m plus 4, m plus 4. Okay, we're going to multiply the numerator to numerator to get this answer. So let's check out if we're going to simplify it. m minus 6, there's no same. m minus 4, there's no same. m minus 5, there's no same. So this is the final answer. Number 7, x squared plus x minus 20 over x squared plus 11x plus 30 times x squared plus 10x plus 24 over x squared minus 16. Now, let's go to the x squared plus x minus 20. It can be factorable. So, this is x plus 5, x minus 4, using the general trinomial. And this one is the difference of the squares. We have x plus 4, x minus 4. So, cancel out the x minus 4 because that's the same. Alright. Then, x squared plus 10, x plus 24. And this one, we're going to um, factor. This is uh, x plus 6, x plus 4. And this one is x plus 5, x plus 6. Now cancel out the x plus 6 because that's the same. And after that, multiply numerator to numerator. x plus 5, x plus 4, x plus 5, x plus 4. Now cancel out the x plus 5, x plus 5, x plus 4, x plus 4 because that's the same. So it means we have 1 and 1. 1 divided by 1 is also 1. Number 8. 2a squared negative a minus 1 over 2a squared plus 7a plus 3 times 2a squared plus 11a plus 15 over 2a squared plus 7a plus 5. Let's go here. Uh, we're going to simplify. Factor. Factor is 2a plus 1, a minus 1. Alright. And here, factor again. 2a plus 5, a minus 1. So we're going to cancel out. No, there's no uh, same here. So let's go to 2a squared plus 11a plus 15. Factor out. Let's factor 2a plus 5, a, a plus 3. And this one is 2a plus 1 and a plus 3. Cancel out the a plus 3, a plus 3 because they're the same. Okay, and then multiply the numerator to numerator. 2a plus 1, a minus 1, 2a plus 5, 2a plus 1, 2a plus 5. A minus 1. A plus 1. Cancel out the same. The so same is to A plus 1 and to A plus 5. So the answer is A minus 1 A over A plus 1. What are the common factors of x squared minus 9 over x squared? 9 is 36 times x plus 6 over x minus 3. So let's get first the common factor. But we're going to get the common factor. Let's do the applications of the multiplication of Russian algebra expressions. This one is going to be factor the denominator. And also this one. So factor of x squared minus 9 is x plus 3, x minus 3. So cancel out the uh, same, the x minus 3 and x. The denominator here. Then this one can be factorable. So let's factor it. x plus 6, x minus 6. Then cancel out the same. And then multiply numerator to numerator. x plus 3 over x minus 6. Now, as you can see, the question is what are the common factors? So the common factor is the one in you that you use to factor out. So the same. So x minus 3 and x plus 6 is. The common factors. 
what must be multiplied by x squared negative 49 over x squared plus 11x plus 20 to get the product of 1. Let's write the given x squared negative 49 over x squared plus 11x plus 28. x squared negative 49 can be factored using difference of two squares. So quantity x minus 7, quantity x plus 7. In denominator, we need to factor using the general trinomial. So this is quantity x plus 4, quantity x plus 7. As you can see, x plus 7 in numerator and denominator can be cancelled. So let's cancel out. And then in order to multiply this one, to find the another answer, we have to multiply this one in x plus 4 over x minus 7. Why? To get the product of 1. So, quantity x plus 4 over quantity x minus 7. So, uh, to check the answer, if you're going to get the product of 1, then this one. x minus 7 cancel out, and x plus 4 cancel out, so therefore that's 1. So, the answer is 1. So, here. But the question is, what must be multiplied? So, the answer is in the uh, green one, the x plus 4 over x minus 7. Multiply your potentials with your plans and it will be equal to your purpose of existence.